Getting started with investing can feel overwhelming, but it doesn't have to be. For beginners, dividend stocks can be an excellent starting point, providing a steady income stream along with the opportunity for long-term growth. In this guide, we'll explore a straightforward framework anyone can follow to begin building an investment portfolio with dividend stocks. Why Dividend Stocks? Dividend stocks are shares of companies that pay out a portion of their earnings to shareholders regularly, typically on a quarterly basis. For investors, this means regular income. You get paid periodically without needing to sell your stocks. Lower risk dividend paying companies tend to be more stable, established businesses. Growth potential. Reinvesting dividends can compound returns over time. Dividend investing can be ideal for those looking for steady income, growth, and financial security without constant market monitoring. 1. Set clear investment goals. Begin by defining what you want from your investments. Ask yourself, are you looking for regular income? If so, you'll want stocks with a high dividend yield. Do you want long-term growth? Consider companies with a track record of increasing dividends over time. Setting goals helps you stay focused and choose stocks aligned with your priorities. 2. Create a budget and stick to it. Decide how much you're comfortable investing without straining your finances. One of the best things about dividend investing is that you can start small and add more over time. Aim to invest consistently. Even small, regular contributions can grow significantly. For example, setting aside $100 to $200 per month for dividend stocks can be a great start. Many brokers offer fractional shares, allowing you to invest any amount even if you can't afford a full share of certain stocks. 3. Choose a reliable dividend stock. Not all dividend stocks are created equal. Here's a simple way to find quality dividend stocks. Look for consistent dividend payers. Seek companies that have paid dividends for over 10 years. Businesses like these are often called dividend aristocrats or dividend kings. Review dividend yield. Dividend yield tells you the annual dividend payout as a percentage of the stock price. For example, if a stock costs $100 and pays $3 annually, the yield is 3%. Pro tip. Look for yields between 2% and 6% to balance income and growth. A yield that's too high may indicate financial instability. Consider dividend growth rate. Companies that consistently increase their dividends demonstrate financial health and growth. Check if the company has raised dividends annually for 5 to 10 years or more. 4. Diversify your dividend stocks. Spreading investments across different industries helps minimize risk. Start by choosing stocks from 3 to 4 sectors you're familiar with, such as consumer staples. These companies provide everyday essentials often less volatile, utilities, known for stable earnings and predictable dividends, healthcare, known for resilience in market downturns, financials, banks and insurance companies often pay attractive dividends. By diversifying, you protect yourself from downturns in any one sector and ensure steady returns. 5. Set up dividend reinvestment or DRIP. A dividend reinvestment plan or DRIP reinvests your dividends into more shares of the same stock, allowing your investments to compound over time. Most brokers offer DRIP options at no extra cost. Here's why DRIP is helpful. Compounding growth. Reinvested dividends buy more shares, leading to exponential growth. Hands-free investing. DRIP makes it easy to grow your portfolio without active buying and selling. 6. Review your portfolio regularly. Set a reminder to check your portfolio at least once a year. Dividend investing doesn't require constant monitoring, but it's good to review dividend payouts to ensure companies maintain or increase dividends. Rebalance if needed. If one stock or sector becomes too large, consider reallocating funds to maintain balance. Adjust your contributions. Increase your contributions over time if possible to boost long-term growth. 7. Stay consistent and be patient. Dividend investing rewards those who stay the course. Don't be discouraged by market fluctuations. Instead, focus on the steady income from your dividends. Over time, the combination of compounding and regular contributions will grow your portfolio. A quick example. Let's say you start with $1,000 invested in a dividend stock yielding 3%, and you contribute an additional $100 monthly. 
With dividends reinvested, your portfolio could grow to approximately $17,000 over 10 years, assuming an average 7% total return per year. Wrapping up, dividend investing can be one of the easiest ways to start building wealth and generating income. By choosing reliable dividend-paying stocks, reinvesting your dividends and staying consistent, you'll have the foundation for a portfolio that grows steadily and supports your financial goals over time.